G'day, Hayden here at Pacific Toyota, giving you the personalized high definition virtual tour of our Subaru Forester. Uh, now, before I jump into the video, well, I thought I'd just explain what a video tour is. So basically what I'm gonna do is show you through the entire vehicle. Uh, so we're gonna start off in the engine bay. As you can see, I've got the bonnet half pop there. Um, so we'll A, make sure there's an engine. Um, as you can hear, it's already running. Um, so it certainly does. Um, but then we'll work our way around the exterior of the vehicle. Um, going through all the paint and panel. Uh, now, if there are any imperfections, I will point them out. I will not try and hide them from you. Um, and then we'll work our way into the interior, going through all the, uh, obviously, the condition, the instrumentals that come with the car, and obviously all the uh, the service history with the vehicle as well. So we'll kick off and we'll jump straight into it. Pop the bonnet here. All right, so inside the car, as you can see, we do have an engine. It is running, as you can hear, um, but it is nice and tidy. Uh, in the engine bay which is perfect. Close this one down. Give you a look up the front of the bonnet now. As you can see it's nice and straight, there's no dents or anything like that. Um, there are a couple of little stone chip marks just on the front of the bonnet here. The one just here which has already been touched up and another one just there. Um, but apart from that there's two little ones here so I can get those ones that haven't been touched up done for you. Um, but other than that, everything else is nice and tidy through the uh, the bonnet there, which is good. Uh, coming through the front bar, as you can see, nice and tidy. You do have a front facing camera. It's all fairly tidy through the front bar area, which is perfect and pleasing to see. Um, factory alloy wheels, so machined outer with a black inner. Um, now they look like they're a 17 or an 18. Uh, yeah, they're an 18 inch um, and we've got a Bridgestone Jeweler highway terrain tire on there. As you can see, there's heaps of tread left on those, which is perfect. Um, so we'll just pop down beside all the panels here on the driver's side. And as you can see, nice and tidy. No visible dents, paint work wise. Slight little mark just here. And another one just here and another one just there. Um, but other than that, everything else is nice and tidy uh, through there. As you can see, we do have genuine Subaru uh, roof racks on the top. Coming through to the rear of the car now. See, we do have your reversing sensors across the rear as well as your reversing camera. Uh, this one does come with the electric tailgate, as you can see there, and then obviously inside the uh, the cab itself in the back here, we've got the floor mat. Um, we've got the premium hardened carton uh, sound system that does come with the vehicle. Obviously, a uh, small subwoofer in the back. 12 volt auxiliary port and obviously you can control the uh the rear seats there as well so i do have the 60 40 fo um, fold split as you can see i do have one seat down there spare tire and everything are just underneath here and as you can see it doesn't even look like that spare tire's ever been used because that's still in the bag close that one down and the way the tailgate drops and that locks into place all right Drumming down these panels here, down the passenger side. Again, all nice and straight, no dents. Paintwork wise, pretty much equally the same. There's a bit of dust on the car at the moment. The joys of being located on a major highway. Camera in the uh, wing mirror there. Bit of a mark just on this door here. But other than that, down that side is an exceptional condition as well. Um, we do have uh, slimline uh, tinted weather shields around the vehicle. Through side here, all the leather all is in fantastic condition as you can see there. This folds down again. So the uh, cream interior, the white interior with the uh, with the black. Uh, really has a nice effect to the vehicle. Um, two 12, uh, two um, USB ports, sorry, and two air vents in the back as well. So we'll jump in, close that door properly. Inside the actual car itself now. 
All right, so inside the actual car itself, we are showing 26,385 kilometers on the clock. Um, as you can see, there are no warning lights apart from the car having almost no fuel. Um, but uh, steering wheel controls, so stereo and Bluetooth on one side, that's all your um, center screen controls there. And then you have all your cruise control with your radar cruise uh, just here as well. Down here, you've got your push button start. You've obviously got your um, uh, your memory for your uh, rear tailgate. That one there controls the rear tailgate. Um, obviously down here, you've got uh, all your dry, uh, extra modes like uh, blind spot alert. Uh, this one here is your eyesight, uh, which generally you just leave on your A stop and then your traction control as well. Um, so really all in uh, with arms reach. Uh, memory seats for the driver. Um, so you have two uh, memory uh, settings there your side mirror and window controls just over here. Uh, eyesight is just up the top here. Um, so I will explain this in more detail um, on the phone with you because it is a pretty complex um, system, the uh, the Subaru Eyesight, and it is um, a hell of a system to be honest. It's, um, I guess, a bit of an innovation, uh, really. They've, um, they've come up with some pretty cool, cool safety technology for the Subarus. Um, I reckon they actually lead um, pretty much every manufacturer in the uh, in the safety technology. Um, now you can see they come up with the uh, the fuel being low. Um, it'll actually search for a fuel station for you. So you can see there all your screen with all your fuel um, gauges and so on and so forth. How many Ks uh, you've got left to the tank? Uh, a nice large display screen. Like Sorry, I said, it is fitted out. It is fitted out with uh, your reversing camera there, as you can see. On the top there, you can see we do have the uh, the front camera, which is showing up that blue car, and then obviously your side camera as well. Um, <clears throat> air conditioning controls, they're all pretty much a standard. Do have your satellite navigation inbuilt. Uh, down here we have uh, 12 volt auxiliary port, uh, two, US, two more USBs, and obviously uh, AUX there as well. Uh, you can control obviously all, all your cameras there. Uh, all your driving modes, so your sports and dirt, your mud and your snow, um, and then your normal. You've obviously got your heated seats, um, auto hold button, and obviously your um, electric park brake there as well. Down in here, obviously the keys for the roof rack, another 12 volt auxiliary port, and a nice large um, center console area there. Service history wise. Oops. We have the first service at 14,000 Ks and then again at 23,000 kilometers and that's been done both with the uh, Subaru dealer. Um, so it's got a full and complete service history. All the books are just in the uh, glove box here. Um, but uh, all in all, inside the vehicle is in exceptional condition. Obviously up the top here, do have that sunroof. Now that is auto, um, so you can just press and release and that'll open and then we can close that back up like so. Now, if you don't want to have the sunroof open, just pull that back and then you have your um, open roof. Uh, without having to open it, you've obviously got the sunlight coming in. Uh, eyesight, obviously you've got your um, lane departure at the top and also your full collision mitigation uh, system there also. Um, turn the radio up so you can obviously hear it. So cover it, decorate it and keep it toasty for less. Sail on now, exclusions apply. So as you can hear there, all the speakers are working nicely. Like I said, it does have a premium Harden Carden uh, sound system. Harden Carden are actually one of the, the leading uh, manufacturers for sound systems on the market. Um, so obviously to have that inside a vehicle is a, a bit of a bonus. Um, so we'll turn the car off with a push button here. We'll jump out and give you a final look over the vehicle now. Um, now the vehicle does come with two remote keys. Um, they are the genuine Subaru key, as you can see there. Um, but that is our uh, Subaru Forester. So I hope you in, uh, enjoy the video. If you do have any further questions, please don't hesitate to give me a call. But I look forward to hopefully doing business with yourself very soon. Cheers.